Here's Stanley Roberts, who found some people behaving badly. At the intersection of Castro Road and El Portal sits the Contra Costa County Mental Health Clinic and the Contra Costa College. Also at this intersection, you will see drivers rolling through the stop sign to cross El Portal and drivers whizzing by, sometimes over the 30 mile per hour posted speed limit. This intersection, according to San Pablo Police Department, averages about three collisions per month. Part of the reason, the stop sign runners and the speeders. And since I'm not a speed expert, I put in a car for one, and Officer Schultz of the California Highway Patrol rode to the scene. And within a few minutes, we were trying to catch up with a red Nissan who's exceeding the speed limit by 10 miles over. We'll go straight through the light. Hey, when the light turns green, go straight. Now, while the officer knows his speed, uh, let's see okay. what the driver knows. Do you know what your approximate speed was? The driver told the officer it was 38. The interesting part was when I spoke to him. Oh, so you had a crash here before? Yeah, but um, it was not my fault at that time, too. This driver was doing, get this, 20 miles over the posted speed limit. Apparently, his car ran on baby power. Right here. You don't understand? Okay, listen in. Maybe this will add some clarity. I stopped you for your speed. The driver claimed the baby was crying. The baby crying, sir. That's why. Okay. That's not an excuse to speed, though. Yep. The driver continued to insist the reason for speeding was because the, just the baby. Sir. In the end, the driver was issued a ticket for speeding and. So, you've got a third child seat back right here, but why isn't the baby in the seat? The point being made here, drivers running stop signs and speeding makes a perfect recipe for collisions, and this intersection is a prime example. This driver was also caught speeding on El Portal. He told Officer Schultz he thought the speed limit was 35. The funny part with all the collisions on the blind curve, the city is actually considering raising the speed limit to 35 instead of maybe putting in a red light. Oh, and when I spoke to the driver, this is what he had to say. I love your show, but uh, it's too bad when it's me. Yeah, I hate when that happens. I seen, I seen the In San Pablo, Stanley Roberts, Cron 4 News.